flights, port services and now tr road transportation have resumed between Ethiopia and Eritrea. Many are hoping the restored economic ties between the neighboring countries will be strengthened by the resumption of these trade routes. Now, Eritrea's ports of Asab and Masawa have started to practically transform way, their way of doing business to deliver economic growth for both countries. CGTN's Gerum Chala reports. Abandoned and left almost unoperational for more than 20 years. And this is the port of Asab here in Eritrea. The port is now seeing light at the end of a tunnel now that Ethiopia and Eritrea have re-established, reconnected their relationship in almost all sectors. The two countries have worked together since Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed and President Isaias Afolge visited the port of Asab in July. And according to authorities, port and road rehabilitation works are being finalized since then for this commercially viable port of Asab. And this is the port of Masawa, the second important port of Eritrea already in operation, but underutilized too. It was this Ethiopian ship that marked the resumption of commercial and port usage ties between Ethiopia and Eritrea. 20 years later, trade and exchange of goods are now slowly taking shape here. With the opening of the road transport between the two states, it's hoped trade ties between Ethiopia and Eritrea will further be intensified. Businessmen are already excited. Investors in Ethiopia, especially those of us young businessmen, are coming here in numbers to work hand in hand with our Eritrean brothers and boost the economic growth of both countries. Already, Ethiopia has bigger ambitions for this port of Mazawa. The government-owned Ethiopian shipping and logistics service enterprise has said that it is hopeful of beating strong competitors to take over this Eritrean port of Mazawa and start providing regular services. We had hoped for port and embassies to be open in the two countries, and now those have been practically delivered. Our ships are mainly transporting bulk cargo from here to China mostly. That has provided benefits for both Ethiopia and Eritrea. We hope you can do more. Ethiopia has already started making money out of its first engagements on Eritrean waters. By transporting 11,000 tons of Eritrea's zinc concentrate export to China, Addis Ababa has made close to $650,000. It is now official. Both ports of Asab and Mazawa are open for business. Ethiopian and Eritrean businessmen can now use these important ports to expedite economic activities between the two countries. Grumjara CGTN, Masawa, Eritrea.